physicians are very much in touch with what their patients need. And if we do a better job of listening to them and supporting them, and that's where I see the value partnership with Blue Cross has allowed that to happen. It invigorates and again re-engages the physician who um, wants to see healthcare redesigned uh, in such a way that there's more time for the patient. You know, as we move from that volume and fee for service to fee for value, um, it translates into improving that relationship. It does take a team um, to move the mark and it, it's letting that physician lead and invigorate his or her team um, helps our whole community as a whole. So we are very appreciative of Blue Cross's commitment to the change and the transition. The advice I would give is to go ahead and start to collaborate as early as possible. Find where there's opportunities to take advantage of those things that have been built as opposed to trying to build again from the ground up. One of the first things you can do is start to find out who's there, collaborate, figure out who are the people that are close to you, who you can work with, who you need to work with because of the population you're managing. And then start from that spot rather than coming to it from the opposite direction, which might be the mechanics of building an IT system and some of those types of things, because those will settle themselves. I think the number one lesson through this program is to be good listeners to those who are delivering the care. So my role as a Vice President of Operations is to listen to our physicians uh, for what they need, what's lacking, what's working, and trying to be a facilitator to uh, transfer those best practices across our organization. And it's Value Partnerships that's allowed us to do that. And those organizations that maybe aren't part of it yet, I think are really being left out. I think there's a lot to be learned from being part of this, and that's really what the messages that I take to the physician community as well is this is a privilege to be part of this. So being part of it, you're actually, um, you're part of the solution. So let's just not point fingers at the problem, let's be part of the solution together. So I think that would be the message. But I think the more we work together and we tackle these problems as a group, as an entity in a state, uh, it makes it that much easier for all of us to do. The work is a whole lot easier when you share it with others, and it's a lot more fun.